Okay, um, just like how I've said in this post here, this, what you see, is a landing page. And it's all inside Infusionsoft. There's no outside software. There's no outside anything. It's all inside Infusionsoft. This is really cool. This is a part of their winter release. I'm really excited about this. I'm sure a lot of marketers will be um, because you don't have to go anywhere else. You can track everything, keep everything inside Infusionsoft and build an entire landing page that looks like this or even better just depending on your design skills and or whoever you hire to design your stuff for you. So let me show you how to do it real quick. Um, it's not too difficult. It's actually really easy. So in your Infusionsoft app, what you have to have is first, you have to have the web form. So you create whatever web form you want, make it look nice. You can use the builder and everything, put in your fields that you want, whatever you're trying to get people to download or, or get a hold of. After you have the web form created, then what we'll do is you will create a new email template. I have already got one created. That is right here. And in here, um, you design your email. So we'll click on edit email. And just like every email in Infusionsoft, when you use the email builder, you write information in and there you go, you got it. Well, what the new win release has added is right here in layout, they've added the option to show a form right there. You just click it on, and then you type in the name of the form. Or as soon as you start typing, it'll have a drop down that will give you options of what. So just like that. And um, there you go. The form is there. This is set up. But then you're like, OK, well, if you have the form, how do you share it with people online? How do, you, how do you get them to do it? Well, along with the winter release, they have added the feature whenever you send a broadcast, you can do this. And this is exactly how I did it. I go to email, send a broadcast just like you've done a thousand times. Or if you haven't done it a thousand times, this is what you do. Let's pick the existing email and get that set up here. There it is. We're going to use that one that I just created and designed. It populates it. We'll go ahead and go next. So in here now we have this. I've checked those boxes because you're supposed to. Um, this is what they've added, the social feature. Um, if you saw the webinar they created, they've added where you can tweet the email or Facebook the email to yourself or to your, your um, fan base and your subscribers and everything. Um, I've set up a Twitter account called SpamSpurt. I don't really use this for SpamSpurt. If you want to follow me on SpamSpurt, go to Jared Kimball. Um, that's my, my tagline. And then all you do is click Done. Check the box. Make sure you have permissions. You have to send this to at least one person. Um, you have to send the email to one person. So I send it to myself. We click on Done. Then what ends up happening is it's going to process it. It has not started yet. Typically it goes a lot faster than this and there we go alright so now it's done it's been sent and then we go to Twitter this is my Twitter account and right here is Spamspurt that I follow click on that link and boom I now have the <laughs> landing page <laughs> in Infusionsoft so all you have to do is just copy this link right here or the one on on the actual landing page itself tweet it out share it, send it, put it on a, on your website, and all they do is they click on that link and it takes them straight to a landing page to opt in, sign up for your stuff, and it's all right inside Infusionsoft. Once again, this is Jared Kimball with, with Spamspurt. Uh, thanks for watching, and hopefully you learned some cool stuff about this.